Hey guys, thank you for joining us again at Car System Installation. Today we're going to show you another case of DIY installation and how does it affect your vehicle. So we've installed the remote starter and alarm in this vehicle, the CompuStar Pro T13. And the customer said that the alarm seems to be drawing power in the vehicle and draining his battery. The customers also mentioned that he installed LED light in the vehicle, but he made sure that they are switched off. So inside the vehicle, he has a switch to turn on and off the lights, but the lights were not installed correctly. And where is the problem? The problem is that the switch maybe turned the lights from being lit up, so you don't see an actual color, but they still got the power. So there's a box in here that was connected incorrectly. Now we're gonna show you how you can see the effect. So right now we have the box disconnected. We have our multi on a, a checking the amps, how much amp the vehicle is drawing. And we can see 0 0.9, 0 0.09 to 0 0.1. We have the alarm, so this is a normal draw. That's okay, the car is locked, the alarm is on. That's a normal draw for the alarm to be working with the vehicle, that is okay and normal. It's not gonna affect your vehicle, it's gonna take a few uh, days before you're gonna have any effect. Now we're gonna take this connection and just gonna plug it in, just gonna touch the positive. This is again, this is the box that was installed to the LED. As you can see here, we didn't change it. It was connected to the battery. Negative is connected and a positive. So we're gonna just touch and look what happened. Whoop, we have a jump to 0 0.76. This is a major draw. This is basically what drains your car. Now the lights are off, there's no lights. But the switch is off, but the power is still drawing. No matter if the lights are on or not, the power is still drawing. This is an incorrect installation. Again, I'm gonna just remove it, and it went off. As simple as that. Again, we're gonna have a wide view. As soon as we plug it in, jump. As soon as we remove it, off. This case, as we see a lot when people do uh, DIY installations and uh, run the wires incorrectly, the first thing they want to always have uh, is to see what is the last thing that was installed and check how it was installed, if it was installed correct or incorrect. For more videos, you can always find us at Car System Installation. Subscribe to our channel. We'll see you next time. Have a good day.